mystery. <laughs> Welcome back, folks, to episode four of Arc Official. And I got a couple ideas today we're going to do, and I want to get started with that, but I think Ouncey found a good spot up there. Like, I think I could probably still access her. Yep, sure enough, I can. Okay. But that being said, let's get on today's with uh, today's episode. Um, let's see. Where are the fertilized egg fridge? Oops. Get a little bit of a leg spike here. One downside on official. Um, so these eggs right here, oh, we're hoping to do a baby giga today. So let's check out on how much time these eggs have real quick. Um, let's just throw them both out and see. 34 minutes and 19 minutes. All right, so we'll... I have a few things I need to do first though like get ready uh, I need to get some meat and one of the things <laughs> there's Kate there um, one of the things I need to do is go grab some meat for the babies uh, but if you do know anything about official arc you know that weekends are events and I definitely want to do it. I did raise them on the weekends a little bit to gain some time on them. They take like 10 days to uh, actually raise. And I'm going to try using a trick because it can be really hard to imprint where I get them to an imprint on one X on normal times. And then on week on the weekend when the breeding goes up to two, I want to see if I can get the imprint in and it will be count as a full imprint I'm pretty sure it will but that will definitely help us out I think um, just with the imprint and making sure we get a hundred percent now keep in mind guys this guy is not going to be fully grown today uh, you know it does take 10 days for him to raise and I don't think you guys want to wait Ooh, you know two weeks a week and a half for the next episode but we will get it started and there's a couple other things I want to do like maybe make some more cryopods that would be a big one uh, for sure we need we're starting to run low on some cryopods so hopefully we'll go up and do that but I'm gonna bring you back when the eggs hatch and I will see you guys in a little bit so we're hoping yours is what purple and black with 805 melee we're hoping mine is black and green with 805 melee mm -hmm. who knows what they'll actually be <clears throat> Ooh, it's a mystery <laughs> I hate myself <laughs> that's gonna be the beginning part Ooh, it's a mystery <laughs> You fucking would. <laughs> oh, one second on mine. Boom. Yeah, watch your damn egg Ooh. and mind your business. Black and green, and green. with 805 melee. Ooh, whoa. Black and orange. Orange and black with... with a green stripe. It's got a green belly case. 805 melee. Really? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Female and female. Well, we got two females with a good melee. Wow, nice. this is actually... I will take this. That's a win. Oh, I didn't I even think of a name. Really like... Oh, this is... Is this black or purple on its back? I don't know. It's hard to tell till it grows... Do you see its belly, though? Your belly is freaking cool. Oh, whoa. This is like a super Halloween giga. Yeah, it is. Green, orange, and either black or purple. I mean... Yeah, you have to give him Happy Halloween, Halloween to me. Yeah. I don't know what to call this guy. A girl. Girl. They're both girls. I gotta think of a name for the girl. Mm. Oh, oh, I'm naming mine Sabrina. Oh, that's a good one. That's a really good Halloween name. Um. Super original. Yeah, but it's a good one. 360 hatch? Oh my gosh. 346 Wait, level. Look at the level of these things. Oh. 
Yeah, I noticed that yours was what a 360. Yeah, but yours is 346 too. It's I mean it's super good. Yeah. Actually, they're identical pretty much. Um, same health and same health and uh, wait. Yeah, let's see. Make sure they're the same. Actually, yeah, they're the same exact health. This is gonna you, sound fucked up. You have less stamina. But uh, we make good babies. <laughs> Oh, that's going to be the new beginning of the video. <laughs> <laughs> that's even worse. Oh. What, what? In the fuck? <laughs> what in the hell? That could not have been more ridiculous. Yeah, I don't... You know what, though? I honestly don't think he's coming down. I think he's just up there permanently. <laughs> said you wanted to change this. Now explain to me what you're doing. Because the roof is off of one part and not the other. Well, first of all, I was going to make that like a second level and have some stairs right here. But now I can't decide. Should I tear everything down and do large walls? Hmm. And keep the bottom huge, or keep the bottom small. Because I could keep the bottom small. I just, I'm probably gonna do like the bigger dinos higher up. I see what you're Not saying. Like, like take get... out these outside walls and make them larges, and then do a second floor up there, and then have an open area here, like a big open area. That is what I was thinking. Or I was thinking I could leave these short walls with this layer here. Yeah. And keep this area just under here and just leave this the way it is. Yeah, I think either way we're fine. What happened okay. to the vault? Oh, you took that down? I Yeah, I had to break it because it's right in the way of my stairs. Alright, no worries. All the resources, everything's in my bird. And this is going to be like our kibble farm. Starter kibble yeah. farm. Yep. All right. It's not going to be anything grand. I mean, I imagine by the time... Well, I can't imagine I'm going to tame yuts and bring them here when we already have the start of a base over in the snow. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. So I'm not going to go too big. I'm just going to get some space to get the freaking iguanodons off the front door. <laughs> well, <laughs> side door. Yeah. Get the vultures out of the ladder area and maybe get some of those listeros over here too just to get them out of the way for the ones that we're not using. All right, sounds good. I'll probably actually help you with it. Okay. Instead of remodeling the shape of the building, I remodeled the inside, and I think I like it like this. But you should come look at it. Oh, give me one second. Ooh, yeah, I actually do like this a lot. Yeah, this is cool. I like this. I think it actually looks pretty nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is what, the door to the back? Oh, okay, got ya. Yeah, um, that can actually get, I can get rid of that at some point. Because I was only using that to get in and out while I was building the, um, um this back part right here. Yeah. But then I got smart, put all my shit on an RG and never got rid of the door. So you just got to put a roof on it now. Yep. I just, I have 12 left. I'm just oh, working nice. on. Oops. And we ended up naming the Giga Sabrina, and mine ended up being named Ultra Karen. I thought it was a very fitting name for her. And now we are up at Blue Ob, crafting up the cryopods that I wanted to. It took a lot of resources. A lot of energy in this episode, but it turned out really good. Hopefully you guys enjoy this and are having as much fun with this series as I am. So I will see you next time.